Hey, what's up guys? It's Pat and today I have another mod review for you guys and this one is the Crystal Dimension mod. It's a really cool mod. It adds um, a bunch of new blocks into the game, new armor, new tools, new weapons. No mobs as of yet, but um, they, I'm sure they're in the works because this mod is a work in progress. And the one thing that's a little different about this mod is this portal right here that leads to the Crystal Dimension, I did not craft it. You actually have to find it, and they spawn in flat areas in the world, so you actually need to do some searching to find one to head to the other dimension. That's the only way, as of right now, that you could head there. It's kind of cool, though, because that gives something like else into the mod that, you know, most of these Dimension mods don't have. What he, What's right here is these awesome pillars. And you can actually craft these. I like these. This is a really good thing for, like, building and stuff. But how you craft these, I'll show you right now. All right, the recipe for it is going to be crystal pillar blocks and a color based on, you know, what color you want to make it. And this ruby is going to come from the crystals. And you're going to find those in the crystal dimension themselves. I will show you that a little bit later. But to cr actually craft the crystal pillars, what you're going to need is crystal stone, which is another thing that you're going to find in the crystal dimension. But you need white stone coloring. White stone coloring is just a bucket of water and some bone meal next to it. So you shouldn't have any problem making that. That should be pretty easy to make. They look really awesome though, I love them. It would be great for some kind of build. And here's some of the other blocks you're gonna find in the mod as well. And some of these cool stones, I really like these stones. These would look awesome for building something. These are the different ores as well. So there's a bunch of different kinds of ores, which means of course there's a bunch of different armors and stuff as well. Here is the sets right here. There's a ruby set, aquamarine set, malachite set, beryl set, and jade set. That's not it, there's a bunch more. And there's the topaz, periodot, Sapphire, Amethyst, and the cool one is the Dense Crystal one. This one's cool. I'll show you guys how to make that in a minute. So right here is the different kinds of crystals that you can get from mining crystals. And there's like a little one, and then there's a big one. So we're going to take a look at this really quickly. The use for this is different, you know, parts of the set that we were looking at before. Also, you can make um, the carved brick that we took a look at. But the one thing that's a little different is um, this, you can make the dense one the bigger one. And what that's used for is creating a multi-crystal. And the multi-crystals, what you need is every single crystal. So all the different nine kinds of crystals. And that makes a special set. So this is the best set in the, in the mod right here, which is the dense crystal set. You can make everything for that. You can make an axe, a sword, a hoe, a pickaxe, and a shovel. So that's pretty cool. So there's a lot of different stuff that you can make with this mod so far, even though it's still a work in progress. Um, one thing I wanted to point out was um, I did notice this in creative. Um, this is obviously not used yet. It is the unused crystal log. And that just makes it seem to me that they're going to be adding trees into the dimension. Right now, there's no trees in the dimension. Um, this is most likely what it's going to be, I would assume, when they actually update that part of the mod. All right, guys. So we are going to head into the dimension now. Um, there is one glitch, and that's sometimes you spawn like really lower under the ground. So hopefully that does not happen. And we have spawned under the ground. This is where I spawned before, actually. So, yeah, that is a glitch that they're working on fixing right now. It's actually a really beautiful dimension, I have to say. D don't ignore this. That's something I put there. But, yeah, this is a really beautiful dimension. And has some actually some awesome structures. This is actually some of the crystals right here. And these are used to craft pretty much all the things that we saw. I really like this grass. One thing that's unique about it is if you take this grass with you and you bring... This isn't... There's ground. Don't worry. It just, it just didn't load. But if you take that... um grass with you and bring it back to the normal world what's going to happen is if you plant it it's all it's going to take over the other world basically and all the grass is going to start turning blue so that's kind of cool i mean if you really like the grass you could bring it with you and you can see that this actually goes down quite low so there's some awesome like it's like awesome cliffs and stuff in this dimension so we'll spend a little time going around it and just taking a look at all the different crystals that spawn because some of them actually look really awesome the way that they spawn you can actually see like the sun shining on the cliffs like far away, which I, I think looks really cool. It isn't something that's actually in Minecraft, and I just think it looks awesome. I love the like the reflection of the light. It just makes this like um, dimension look really cool. Here are some of the crystals, but there's, you should be able to find all the different types. And actually mining those, I noticed with like an iron pickaxe is like super slow. So all the new um, tools are much better. There's some more crystals over there as well. And as you can tell, guys, this is a work in progress. They're obviously going to be adding more. There's no mobs at the moment, but once they start adding stuff like that, that's going to be pretty cool. Here is some of the green ones. So if you spend a lot of time traveling, you're basically on top of these big mountains overlooking the water. Okay, here's one of the awesome ones. When I look at this, I think it's like, look at it. It looks like a, the end of a giant sword, doesn't it? I think that's how it looks, but I think it's pretty cool. 
Anyways, guys, that's about all there is in the Crystal Dimension for now. But um, th what this mod adds is an awesome looking dimension, a cool way to enter it, a bunch of tools and stuff, and some awesome building blocks. I have to say, I really like the building blocks that were added into it for decorations and stuff. Anyways, guys, uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe for some more great videos. I will see you next time.